Hey everybody, it's Himani. Welcome to Fresh Friday where I share DIY beauty remedies with you. They're all based on ancient beauty secrets and a lot of them have been passed down to me through generations. I've just come back home and I've got whatever's left of the eyeliner, but I've taken my makeup off from everywhere else to show you how you can remove the facial hair naturally at home. This home remedy is actually a homemade face mask and if you use it regularly, it's actually known to help you get rid of facial hair completely and permanently. This has been one of the most highly requested videos by you. It's really simple, it'll save you a lot of money, it's 100% natural and it's really good for skin. You can actually find all the ingredients in your own kitchen pantry. The kind of facial hair we're talking about today is the peach fuzz that we have on the sides of our face, on the forehead, and even on the nape, nape of your neck. If you want to watch an eyebrow tutorial or upper lips tutorial, leave me a comment down below so I'll do that video for you. And make sure you subscribe so you don't miss it when I do upload the video. Before I jump into it, I just wanna say that we're not supposed to be perfect. I'm not perfect. I'm just a regular girl like you, just chatting with my friends, you guys. It really broke my heart on several occasions to read your continuous comments and messages saying how having facial hair really affected your confidence. You're perfect the way you are and everyone has facial hair. It's part of being human. And you don't have to worry, nature has answer to everything. And you're at the right place because in our little family here on YouTube, we're all very incredibly supportive of one another. So on that note, let's jump into it. You'll need coconut oil. I prefer the extra version cold press variety as that has the most nutrients in it. Wholemeal flour, you can use the one that you use for baking. And some water, it's free. <laughs> I'm starting by prepping my skin with coconut oil and I'll make sure to massage it in gently until it's fully absorbed into my skin. Make sure you cover all the areas that you're targeting. <laughs> that sounded so funny. <laughs> Coconut oil acts as moisturizer, antifungal, antioxidant, and also acts as a multi-nutrient skin food. Next, I'm going to mix water with three tablespoons of wholemeal flour. You can take more flour if you have a wider area to cover. Add as much water as necessary to make it this sort of consistency. When you've got it really nice and thick like this, then it's time to apply it on your face. Apply it in the direction of hair growth, which is downwards. Now it's really simple. We're going to let it dry until it's about 90% dry. It usually takes about 10 to 15 minutes, but it'll vary with the weather conditions. Now that it's 90% dry, I'll start by rubbing it off using upward and outward motions like so. Be sure that you're not dragging it down, but that you're pulling it off upwards and then outwards. I'm going to do this until all of this is almost gone. It doesn't take long at all. So I've just washed my face with plain water. At this stage, it's normal for skin to feel a little tight. I'm going to tell you how often you can do this to see the results very soon. But I've got to tell you, what we're going to do now is extremely important for the health of your skin, whether you use this method for the sides of your face, or you tweeze your eyebrows, or you use threading or waxing for upper lips. Whenever you use any hair removal method, please make sure that you take toner on a cotton wool pad and apply it on your face like this to close all the open pores. You can take cold green tea as well, it works great. Then the most important thing is to apply a serum or a moisturizer that has ingredients like vitamin D3, linolenic acid. This step is actually skipped by even some professionals sometimes, but it's a very important step because these ingredients have anti-inflammatory and healing properties that really help to calm the skin down after any hair removal method. I would highly recommend O Cosmeceuticals Calming Serum because it has all these ingredients 
ingredients and more. It even helps to alleviate any redness or itchiness if your skin is sensitive. It's also great if you've been exposed to sun or microdermabrasion. You guys know that I'm so particular about ingredients and I spend a lot of time researching before picking out any skincare product to see if they've got the ingredients that I'm looking for. Oh, Cosmeceutical skincare products are natural products that are based on ancient Ayurvedic secrets. They have stable packaging and most importantly, their work. If you find that your current skincare products aren't making much of a difference, try our cosmeceuticals. You'll be so glad you did. So I'm going to apply the calming serum on my face and I'm good to go. It acts as my primer as well, so I can wear it underneath my makeup if I wanted to. I don't know if you guys can tell, but it's instantly calmed my skin down and these beneficial ingredients are going to keep nourishing my skin throughout the whole day. When you're just starting out with this recipe, please make sure you use it twice a week with a gap of at least two days in between and please make sure you do it without fail for at least a month so it'll be four weeks of twice a week treatment and after that you can start using it once a week there's no time limit to how long you can use this for you'll see that the longer you use it for the less you'll need to use it that's because it stops the hair growth to a large extent and the results vary on the thickness of hair i guess but I've seen people using it for one and a half months or two months and realizing that the majority of the hair is gone. It costs almost nothing, it's simple, it works, it doesn't hurt to try it out. <laughs> Make sure you subscribe for new videos every Touch Up Tuesday, Fresh Friday and Subby Sunday. You can click on subscribe button here or if you're watching on mobile phone or tablet, I'll put a link in the description box for you. For more beauty inspiration, feel free to check these videos out. I love you so much and I'll see you very soon. Bye!